This is why you should love and appreciate your TOs. Until I hit a dodgeball at Dill's face, I wait bounce for it. <laughs> okay? <laughs> and now, you know what, actually? Does numbers count as a, a, a... No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't count as like a TO or anything. Nah. Sad. <laughs> you were thinking about throwing this. Perhaps. <laughs> this is for sets. every header you've thrown this at me. This is every, every single header you've thrown. Every single, like, best of 10 you've done. <laughs> Sick of it. <laughs> God, but now we have done numbers versus Deluxe. Really, really fabulous Falco player I, I've been watching uh, recently. You know, I, I'm, I'm loving Stillens coming out to New York. Uh, I used to Zeno so often now. And numbers. High numbers. High green me fit. Yeah. Yeah, but no, Steelix has been playing wow. insane Three of them. as of late. Oh my god. No. Oh, no, I think Steelix might have thought he still had a jump or just the down air uh, lag was too much. There, there we, go. we go. Getting that one. Yep. Second time's a charm. That's you know. fine. Okay, not, not if it's so bad. We, we trade uh, a stock. I love that for us. We're back to, we're back, you know, we started again. We have Deep Breathing active for We Fit, of course, doing the soccer ball and a really good trade there, kind of just giving them both another even uh, just uh, lead for one another. Yeah. Trying to get another downer off the corner and numbers not allowing that to happen, but Steelix not getting anything off of that, unfortunately. And of course, you know, Steelix is going to have to play so well around these projectiles, but Falco, a character that can certainly do it. He's got the mobility, he's got the frame one reflector that, yep. you know, even if it doesn't catch... Um, even if it doesn't catch projectile, it's such a good space control tool, especially the way that Numbers likes to stall off stage. It's going to be so good as just like, no, stop it. Oh, really good drift from Numbers in order, you know, kind of psyching out Steelix by, air, by um, no, air dodging over to the right and then drifting back onto the left to completely avoid the side B, uh, just, just 100%. Really smart on Numbers' part. Deep breathing active, a little bit of healing as well. And the forward tail actually coming out faster than the down smash. Really smart again from Ooh. numbers. And now not getting anything off of the uh, smash right there. Yeah, still it's trying to go for some tricky movement, nice. trying to run down John's shield. But John is so patient, especially you know when it comes to his shield. We see him, you know, angle that shield a lot. He's very patient. Now speaking of patience, you know, chilling at ledge, ledge's friend as always. But coming in with some forward airs now putting Steelix at ledge. All right, here we go. We have something that we see very often. Numbers kind of on the ledge, doing what he does best, and Steelix taking a really good control of center stage. But unfortunately, the real control you need is the ledge. That was such a good call out there by no. Numbers, catching the tomahawk grab into a grab of his own, which converted into the game-winning kill. Would Numbers be an honorary TO? Just for one day. Just to wait bounce for. <laughs> just, in, just for enough time for me to throw a Just for enough time him. for me to just header him, okay? <laughs> you just walk up to John and headbutt him? <laughs> no, but with the dodgeball, I think it'd be really funny. I would do the community of service. <laughs> I'll be so doing funny. everyone a favor. Ooh, some Ooh, Zelda, Zelda music, music? counterpart. Yes, we're, we're, we're really choosing Yo, do here. Theme. No, do, Ca do, do, wait, do Dirt Valley. Ah, oh, what are you doing? Okay, this is, oh. It's not bad. It's fine. It's just... It's Gruda's Valley is right there. Yes. Also, Cass's theme pops. And Cass's theme! Y'all had options. I'm disappointed. I'm disappointed. <laughs> I, I, know disappointed. I know which one of y'all picked this. I'm shaming you. It wasn't numbers. Daddy wasn't numbers. At least it's Majora's Mask music. Yeah. Best Zelda game, don't at me. That one's the one that actually scared me as a kid, so you know what? It's yeah. a scary game. It's, it's, it's so unintentionally dark. And then, oh, but right now, oh Steelix God. is looking at pretty scary, putting some big damage now on John Numbers, and it keeps going. Looking to catch again with the up tilt, but putting yourself off stage with the side B, able to make it back. Ooh. I, John Num those down smashes are evil. Those are those down smashes are calling out, I know you're going to drop down with buttons. I'm yeah. gonna low profile it and then you're gonna blow up. Oh my oh, god. But instead John blowing Look up. Look at numbers in the <laughs> he looked, <laughs> he, he, His eyes followed Wii Fit. <laughs> <laughs> that was insane. <laughs> Numbers just follow me through off screen into the real world out of sleep. <laughs> <laughs> we fit popped out of the, the TV. <laughs> I'm sorry, y'all. So back to the game at hand. Silex having a really, really good lead on numbers. A whole stock and more at this point. 
Yep, lapping John numbers in percent right now, and catching John and pushing buttons them. from the ledge again. Two ledge is Dunkley. not friend. No, ledge is awful evil. No good, very bad friend. Friendship ended with ledge. All right, <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe my you're new fine. Friend. <laughs> oh my goodness, maybe a little bit of a. Uh, um, not too much of a hill to climb for numbers. We definitely see him do much, much more. Um, at least with when deep breathing is, of course, active and some citation is uh, discharged. Uh, but Ooh. I'm sure. I I'm glad he isn't throwing it out as often because Falco does have that frame one reflector. And now Silix is suddenly even with numbers. This is the numbers curse. I see this happen the all the time. Curse. This happened two weeks ago at Waypoint with Carflow. He had two stock lead against numbers, and the numbers just like deleted him. I don't know how he does it. Yeah, no, sometimes John, for as patient of a player as he is, he can pick those openings so well, especially when he gets that deep breathing, and just yeah. explode you. And you're like, wait, what happened? I thought this was Wii Fit. That's what I'm saying. But now we have Felix finally taking Ooh. another like, great lead against numbers and just kind of taking a penny and going, not taking a penny, you know, just going the mile as he should. All right, John had to had to go all the way out to the blast zone because he used his air dodge so early. He knew that Steelix could absolutely scout out anything like a like a deep breathing or a sun salutation charge. Ooh, all right, finally really using that using reflector. reflector. Did just a little bit of damage on numbers, pushing him as a little bit further away from the blast zone and forcing Ooh. him into a really really awful situation. You go that high up, Falco can absolutely just fly to you. He's got the hops. The bro just floats to you. Look, right. he did it in the. Oh, you can't see it, but he did he it in the victory it. animation. Y'all, y'all seen Falco for the victory animation many uh, yeah. times. Yeah, y'all, y'all seen it. I just want to see the right here. No, not right here. Is the second stock. It's John's, <laughs> where he just like looks away. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Numbers die. I'm sorry. Hurry up. Oh no, I think it was the first one where he looked away. No, he looked away in the oh, first one. No. Oh, it's okay, it's okay. We, you know we can watch it again? Um, on YouTube in like five minutes. House of 3000 at YouTube. In like five minutes. Subscribe. Subscribe. And subscribe to Twitch Prime. Please. Do it. Alright, but now John with a music counterpick of his own. I think this is, this is, I'll face myself, right? Mm -hmm. I think so. I, think, I don't know. I, I don't play Persona. I'm sorry. Oh, Ooh. the charge of the fire. I don't know about no going upward. I feel like going back into center stage might have been the play there. I'm not going to lie. Steelers. I don't think he realized that he was going to catch numbers in there. Because I thought numbers was going to get the dare spike, like, off the stage. Ooh. And instead it landed onto the actual, uh, it landed on the stage. Ooh, trying to. Throwing out the bear a little bit too late there. Steelix going high that time, making it back to center stage. Now trying to pressure John in the corner. Those big old uh, really multi-hit good. hitbox. Really glad there was a parry on the hula hoops there. That's been, mm -hmm. Those has been like the bane of Steelix's existence sometimes. Ooh, and there we go. John actually punishing the reflector. Obviously, it's such wow. a, an important tool in this matchup. But if you're not reflecting the right things, then you're getting punished. Oh no, that's so unfortunate for Steelix. Steelix was going for like a, a drag down or a stage spike there. Yeah. Unfortunately, just dragged himself down a little bit too far. Meanwhile, John Numbers is going to be sitting pretty with his fur. Never mind. Oh, look at him in the camera. Me too, John. Ooh. No means. No, I, I think it's something to, that's very difficult to do against someone like Numbers is do a stage Ooh. spike on him. He's very good at picking up a lot of like tight situations, and I'm pretty sure he will attack it against the stage. It's hopeful. Okay, wow. John, John had wow. the crouch. My eyes were following the sun salutation, so I didn't see John crouching. <laughs> you just didn't see John. Yeah. John is feared. No, he... he bl <laughs> Green Wii Fit blends into the small battlefield background, especially on the left side. Yeah. He was just gone. <laughs> Camo. Ooh, wow. Okay. But speaking of being gone, is Steelix's second stock with a deep breathing up air. Now John just chilling back at Ledge's friend, waiting out those invincibility frames. Trying to actually trying to bait Steelix out into throwing out those big multi hit oh, wow. hitboxes. Surprisingly, Feather um, didn't hit John at all. Yep. Ooh, Just right. kind of chasing John around the stage through the platforms and everywhere. We were going the distance and we are trying to take the mile. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, no, John, he's, he's got that drift. You wouldn't think Weefa has, like, insane, the insane air drift that she does. Oh, now you've got deep breathing. This oh is my looking goodness. big Almost. rough for Steelix right now. John sitting at 22 on his second stock. Steelix has to make a miracle happen right now. 
a potential edge guard here could be the start of a miracle. No, but there's a little, bit, a little bit of hesitation, unfortunately, which ended up in, you know, Steelix eating a forward tail and a little bit of a, an up air as well. Soccer ball, no sun cell. Ooh. I'm actually surprised yeah. Steelix lived that after missing the tech, but I nice think trade. that was a back air. Numbers, why, why did you look so aggressive when you said you won? Numbers, you won. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. The, you, the scary bird can't hurt you anymore. The scary bird isn't He's real. He's gone. I do like that one of Numbers' quirks is that, like, in order to focus, he takes off one of his masks. Right. I love it. It's like uh, Shadow with the, the, the bracelets. The bracelets. It's Goku yeah. with his little, like, the weight uh, on yeah, him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's everything. <laughs> so back air. And yeah, then, that was back air. Yeah, and then it was back air. It was. It just looked cursed. That was an. Look at this. <laughs> uh, yeah, no, he, that was an aggressive controller pull. You, you won. It's okay. <laughs>